Hello, in this video we are going to create a button widget, um, but what we're going to do is we're going to contain everything inside a class. So let's just quickly remind ourselves what we have on the screen here. This is the code that we developed in the GUI root class video. Um, so when I run this, I import TK enter as TK. Um, I, I have the instructions to, for the display class. Um, and this is the first piece of code that runs. And it says, OK, I'm going to make a variable called display. And then when I write the name of the class with parentheses like that, the program stops. It says, oh, I want you to create an instance of the class. And what does that mean? It means come up here and run the constructor. The constructor is a special method that is run whenever we call a class. So when it runs the constructor, I create my root, my main window object. I give it a title, which I've changed to GUI button class, and then my main loop, which basically starts up your program and waiting for the user to do something. What I'm going to do is this is where I create widgets. Okay, so the first step, just like before, is that I have to create the button. But because I'm dealing with classes, I have to say self.btn1. The only difference is that all my variables right now have to have the, the, the prefix self in front of it. And I say tk.button, and I'm going to attach this to self.root, which is the window that the widget will be associated with. And I'm going to make the text called button1. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to say self.btn1.pack. Because remember, the first thing when I create a widget I have to do is to kind of build the widget, set those, those different properties of the widget, and then I have to actually pack it into the main window. Again, we're not worried about how it gets packed. We're just having the program do it for us right now. A little later on, we'll look at some options to kind of position things. So if I run this now, there it is. It looks no different than what I did when I did this without using this class structure, but this will set you up for some more complicated things a little later. And again, if I wanted to create a second button, I could just do self.btn2, call it button2, and then I want to pack it. So I self.btn2.pack. And there we go. I hope that helped.